Not the best looking jersey, but yeah, tour of Qatar, 500 meters to go, six wheel, went down, did not get up, but I did actually, finished, a bit less skin off than when I started. I've been racing bikes for quite a while now, probably uh, rode a bike before I could walk maybe, uh, but do remember at a young age, five, six, doing sort of carnival grass track racing uh, but I think I won my first race when I was maybe seven or remember it uh, as one of the first wins mainly because I beat my brother it was a under 14s race and uh, Dean was still still racing uh, and yeah I beat him they gave the little boy a, uh, nearly half a lap head start on a 500 meter and yeah I managed to hold on and take the win so yeah it's been a while and yeah I still get ribbed now for being the uh, old boy in the peloton but I'm still enjoying bike riding and I'm sure the boys are enjoying my experience. It's not easy to always get out and still doing your four hour five hours so there's, there's different things in my life now it's not just fully cycling but I've won some races I've lost some races but some of the uh, highlights yeah do stand out one's got to be winning the uh the national road race so it's so really always you know everyone wants to win the national road race and uh managed to managed to pull that off myself and steve cummings going to the line up in uh in north yorkshire winning that that was a really big highlight then went on you know to wear the wear the champs jersey for a year when i was living out in belgium yorkshire born yorkshire bred you know and I have lived, I've lived all over, lived in the States, yeah, France, Italy, so it's great, it's great being away, but coming home is just different, like I say we've been out on just, how far we've been, we've not been like 5k radius of the house here, and we've, we've got some great climbs, gorgeous scenery, so, so pretty spoilt really, living where we live, and then if you want to venture further, you can go into, into, into Derbyshire and expand into Yorkshire even more, and it's a great place. The weather's not always the best, but say on a day like today, there's no place like home. And like I say we've got we've got big races now in uh, in Yorkshire. Obviously the Tour of Yorkshire, but the Tour came here, and a lot of the lads were saying, "Oh, Yorkshire's ace." But what have you done to the weather and that? So if we could turn the weather up a few few degrees, then it would be unbelievable. And I think everyone would want to live here, so it wouldn't be a good a place. <laughs> Whatever you fancy doing, you can do it. Like I say, we went for a, went for a walk with a dog today, and that that's normally something that I do on a rest day, totally unwind, and then like I say, look forward to a few cups of coffee. And like I say, we're out here now in, on a gorgeous day. It's, it's pretty relaxing to uh, sit around here, get the binoculars out, see what see what's happening around in the uh, in the surrounding areas. But yeah, just just generally relaxing, just shutting down the brain really from all the oh all the uh, hype and the stress. Well with this lap and then up to the top of this uh, steep hill was one that my dad would say yeah don't go any further than the top of Car Hill and know where you are then son if you got a flat tyre or you get run over by a tractor or anything so I'd come and get you but no it's good memories around here. Everyone always uh, asks the old question what are you going to do when you retire? I don't think I'm going to be a farmer but like I say, we uh, we rescued a couple of lambs, and it's it's quite it's quite nice, like you say, on rest days to do something different, totally switch off. So I'm not getting any younger, but I still love the sport. And even if I wasn't still a pro bike rider, I'd be going out on the bike and uh, going out with the lads. We went up the uh, up the lane from Furbeck earlier to it, and I've had some shocker of a days up there in the winter, summer. End up nearly crying my eyes out uh, back in the day when. We had to sprint up to the sprint up to the church, and then your your day was done. So, so pretty special, and to have it have it now on the doorstep, actually <laughs> behind us here, is pretty nice. So, getting my day is gonna it's gonna be definitely a special day. So, yeah, looking forward to that really. 
I'd definitely like to win a stage of Tour of Britain, never ever done that. Been seconds, thirds, fourths, fifths, all sorts. I think I was fifth or sixth overall one year, so it's definitely become a harder race than when I was fifth and sixth in it or something. So, yeah, be a tall task to get up there on GC, uh, but I say, who knows, and I will be yeah, sort of fighting every day to get keep up there and uh, see how we go in the sprints in the final. We're not going to go into it thinking, yeah, we can win this bike race, but we can definitely be in the bike race and, uh, yeah, do something for sure. We've been on fire a lot lately in crits and in road races, so I can't see why we can't mix it with uh, some of the world's, world's best bike riders.